Light with sugar. That's me. Oh. Yeah. Hey, Mark, I'll put yours over here. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, this one's for you. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. I've been in surgery. I just heard. She's all right. Well, do you think they need me in there? Oh, well, Joe is in with them right now, and uh, they know you're here if they decide to do a C section and need an assist. Okay. But, uh, I was pretty concerned. I wouldn't mention the possibility. Gotcha. Um, you know, because of the difficulties that you're having, I, I well, have I my... The, uh, the whole new thing's been resolved. Good. We decided to end it, and uh, all that's really left now is the paperwork. Oh, I see. Well, I am... Um, I just thought maybe if, uh, if, if Bobby wanted to come over and play with Joey sometime or spend the night or something, give you a bit of a break. Thanks. Thanks a lot, look. If the boys want to do it, that's great. You don't have to make any special arrangements for me, okay? Thank you. Excuse me. Oh. This is a surprise. I heard you calling all over the house, and I was wondering if you'd come in here. I've been waiting for almost an hour. Yeah? See, I came in and I called your name and I didn't get any response, so I assumed. That mm -hmm. I was here. So I see. Moment by moment. Yeah, well, that's, uh... That's good enough for me. So how cool your job, Brooke? Oh, it's very exciting. I mean, I still miss the old crowd, of course. This has to be in uh, Chicago in the morning. Okay, there's a car you're waiting. Be sure and keep Laura for me. Hello. So, why am I in trouble? Your favorite ex-senator just bought Trend. Travis? Uh -huh. I don't believe it. Well, I didn't either, but it's true. How can the FCC sanction a felon getting media control? You were the only one who ever accused him of a felony. There was a Senate investigation. Yes, and it didn't show anything. Except maybe he was framed by a certain silver-haired mogul. Look, you saw those figures. I don't know how he did it, but he covered his tracks. I am pleased for him, that's all I can say. Oh, well. It still cost him a shot at the Senate. He didn't deserve that seat. Well, you want to agree that we will disagree on this or what? Why are you always so willing to make him an exception? When I've been one little rule... Isn't it obvious? No. I love you. And working for Travis is not going to change that. You're not working for Travis. Why not? <laughs> you can't. It's impossible. He's a liar and a cheat. Well, I don't agree. And he's getting ready to marry Erica Kane. You remember her? How do you think she's going to react when she gets wind of this? You're going to be out in your... And she's going to take over. That's probably what they planned in the first place. It's kind of a, a joint vendetta. No. Quit first. Right now. Is that an order? If it has to be. Well, I don't take orders from you. Not now and not ever. Now, if you would like to have some dinner with me... Okay. How can you be so blind? Fine. I will see you at home. Hello, Brooke. Carla. What was the reaction? She's, she's going to work for him. She saw those figures, and she is an investigative reporter, and she's going to work for him. Very funny. I never thought Brooke the type to be susceptible to that kind of persuasion. What do you mean? Well, Travis can be very charming. Oh, no, no. It's, that's, that's, it's just a matter of principle with her. If it were principle, she should quit. 
No, with me, not him. If I say yes, she has to say no. I wouldn't. You wouldn't what? Say no. I'm going. I don't need DNA. I have K-A-N-E. I'm going out there and I'm going to look right into the face of that baby. And if that baby is Miranda, I will know. And if that baby is Bianca's, I'm going to rip apart everybody out there. And my condolences to your family because you're a dead man. I think Alex was once involved with something like this, uh, some of his father. Well, the problem is the minimum investment in this is more than you have. Well, I have, for that matter. Well, then why isn't bringing it up? Well, I was hoping that you had an additional source that you could tap. Palmer, in particular. No! Absolutely not. Natalie, I'm sure he'd be happy to do it for you. No, I won't ask him! And I won't press. Okay? Well, let's talk about... How about Timothy's father? Is there a, a, a trust fund or something that you could borrow against? Huh. What's the going rate for acorns? I'll buy it. <laughs> My first husband was a very complicated man. And there was a great deal of confusion at the time of his death. We were on the verge of separating. Anyway, he became bitter and wrote a will, leaving everything to a wildlife preserve. <laughs> Acorns. Acorns. Oh. <laughs> it does help to laugh at it. <laughs> well, you didn't try to break this will? Oh, there was another will. See, when he found out that I was pregnant, he videotaped a will, leaving everything to the child with the generous stipend. For me, only. <laughs> oh. Only what? Oh, this is not the least bit funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My mother erased the tape. Oh, you've got to be kidding. <laughs> anyway, after everything that's happened, it, it strikes me as being very funny. What? I would... I admire your self-control. <laughs> oh, well, I, I considered strangling her, believe me. But we survived. Well, I must say, as your lawyer, I strongly suggest that you pursue this, Natalie. Now... Alex's son is Jeremy, isn't that right? Yes, uh, but I don't want to bring him into this. Well, he clearly seems to want the best for you. He is, uh, he's protective of Timothy. Alex made life very complicated for Jeremy and me, and we've only just begun to be friends again, and I won't jeopardize that, for Timothy's sake. How long does it take to check on someone? Maybe Ruth stayed to help out. Well, oh, Mona, if I were having a baby, I'd want Ruth in my corner. Oh, Nikki. Oh, the idea. The idea of you having a baby. I don't know. I'll try anything once. I just wish that I knew what was going on in there. That's it. Keep your focus. That's a good girl. That's good girl. Yeah. Hey, oh, can I push? No, not yet. Not yet. Oh, I have to. Scott, who's centimeters to go yet? Alex, huh? now breathe. Don't push her. Don't push her. Oh. Just breathe. Look at me. Look at me. Uh, Concentrating. Uh, and uh, breathe. Uh, 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 you breathe. Now you breathe. Oh. 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 Oh, you. Uh, your mother sends her love. So does your sister and your brother. Oh, and thank you. Oh, thank you me. very much. Oh, Ruth, if you knew that labor was like this, the human race would be extinct. <laughs> Here you are, Peter. Have some ice. You know, I think oh, okay. you know, that's, uh, I think that labor was designed to offset the teenage years. Mm -hmm. The memory of what you go through to have them is the only thing to keep you from killing them. Mm -hmm. Amen. <laughs> Okay, okay. Come on, Mr. Leon, we've got a little... What's the matter? Nothing, that's right. Just can't be at two places at one time. Come on, Angel. Concentrate. You can't do that. Yes, not yet. Breathe. Breathe. 
Yes. Yes. 